Hello everyone, my name is Carlos Salcido with Guitar Center and this is What's New from NAMM. And we're going to be talking about the iConnect Audio 2 Plus. What we're showing here today is this uh, new audio interface. Well, I'll just take you down the front panel here to see what we've got. We've got two combi inputs on the front here. This is for connecting your microphones or your uh, guitar. You can switch these to high impedance mode for guitar inputs or uh, low impedance for instruments. Plus a 48 volt phantom power will go into there as well. We have a touch panel on the front. This touch panel is used to configure some basic operations of the device, for example, turning on phantom power or high impedance mode, setting your input gains, your output level gains for the outputs and the uh, headphones, along with the, with the encoder knob here that's used to set the levels. So now we're going to flip it over to the back and see what we have around the back side here. So around the back side here, we've got the power jack. So the, that's where you know, plug in the, uh, a power adapter. Now, that's an optional power adapter with this device because this is a bus-powered audio interface. So you can power it directly from your computer and you would connect your computer into this USB jack here. So that USB jack provides your power plus your connection to, to the computer. Now, we also have some additional USB jacks on here because one thing that we can do with our, with our audio interface is we can connect to multiple computers at the same time. So we can have two computers connected to the air and you can and send audio digitally between the two computers. Uh, we also support an iPad. So if you're using the optional power adapter, you can actually supply power to your iPad. And you can use your iPad as an effects device. You can send the uh, audio signals coming in from the front into the iPad for a guitar simulator uh, plug-in, for example, and send that audio digitally through our box back to your DAW to record it. So this handles all your MIDI and all your audio digitally. So then moving over here, we have a pair of standard 5-pin uh, DIN sockets for your MIDI. And on the outputs, we have six outputs. So we've got four line outputs. These are balanced TRS jacks along with a headphone jack. And the, head and the headphone jack is a separate mix from what you see on the one, two, and three, four outputs. So it's a two input, six output device. Thank you very much for spending the time to go over this with me. This, again, this is Scott from iConnectivity. We talked about the iConnect Audio 2 Plus. My name is Carlos Salcido with Guitar Center, and this is What's New from NAMM.